many people already aware of this invoice split functionality how it happens why it happens and how to avoid this however i am just trying to reiterate it and uh, explain in layman terms uh, to the people who are not aware of this uh, functionality and if they get any issues uh, they with they receive any tickets and this invoice split uh, concept then it will be helpful for them to analyze that issue even in better ways there might be different reasons why invoice split happens uh, yeah so the first thing is that in the copy controls uh, you see here then copy controls we have this assignment and reference number field these two fields is a link between invoice and accounting document it is a link it's it it links between sales document and fi document both these fields will help fi users to uh, track the sales document numbers from fi document assignment number and reference number will be used by the fi users in fi reporting so if we get any issues on split criteria we can check here whether assignment number and reference number is same so this is one of the reason why the split happens the second reason is that there might be difference partner has been determined and the invoice said there a partner in the sense uh, sole to party bill to party and payer if any of the partner is not uh, matching i mean both are different means uh, then the split will happens the third and important thing is that uh, if there are different values in the header invoice header fields then it will obviously takes place there are so many fields uh, so in one of the model pro program sap mv 60a uh, sap added some fields for which the split should be avoided you see here in the sap mv 60a there is even include called mv 60a top in this include there is even structure i have highlighted here that is a u s n a h m e tab in this structure they have defined a few fields like um, net value invoice number document condition number uh, created by created on changed on changed by date account key cancelling document account key and billing category if any of the so if if uh, if there is a different values in the header of two documents then split won't ha happen that means the split will skip validation on this fields as per structure and uh, you might think that uh, so you can add one field for example shipping condition so for example a uh, split happening for the shipping condition and you want to avoid that then you can add here but still if you add that here means it will be applicable to uh, globally it will be applicable to all the billing types but it should that shouldn't happen that's not a uh, advisable or suggestible to go with there are some other ways to avoid the split that we can discuss later so apart from this fields for any other fields definitely if value mismatches means split will happen for sure this fields it will be ignored um and moreover there might be some changes written that uh, data vbrk vbrp at the item category level in the copy controls uh, the transaction code is vt uh, fl and vt fa vt fl for uh, uh, delivery to billing and vt fa for order to billing uh in the table tvcpf we can see those configs uh, 